Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Maniology Lost Gold stamped with Floatsome and Maniology MXM058. I've started my manicure off with Neltex Formula 2 and this is the stamping polish Lost Gold. This is in my last Maniology box, Mani and Me. Maniology MXM058 will be our plate today and we're just going to go in and use the stamping polish as a base color. Yeah, yeah, because you can do that. <laughs> if you didn't know, you can do that with these particular stamping polishes. Some stamping polishes do not recommend that, like Mundo de Unas. They do not recommend that you put that directly on your nail, so at least this one can be a dual purpose polish. Beautiful gold, though, with that hollow and pretties. Hi, Woody. How you doing? All right, so we just did one coat. I'm going to put down I&M out the door, a fast-dry top coat to dry this down so we can do some playing. I only needed one coat for this because it's super opaque. No visible nail line. There we go. Here's a swatch photo of it on its own. And we got out the MXM 058, and this is Flosum. All of these uh, polishes and this plate came out of the same box, so just bear with me while I try to get through using some of these new things. I've got this manicure and another one out of the same box. So I've just decided I'm going to use different images from all over this plate on my nails today. I'm trying to figure out which one I want to use next. I'm going to flip this plate around, make it easy to get to. And, eh. There we go. Pick up. I'm going to clean up that excess on the stamper with a little piece of tape. And then I'm going to apply this one to my fingernail. Love that little crab. There we go. And then we're going to flip this plate around again. <laughs> Hope I'm not making y'all dizzy with this, but the girl, she's got issues. I really loved this image. Uh, you know, I don't even know. It's like a map with a compass or something on it. I love it. I think it's a really cool image. We're going to pick that up. Get that excess off of the stamper. Not that I think it would really matter. But you know, if you don't have to get it on your skin or it's not going to mess up your nails. Look at the cotton hair stuck. Oh, you know, you just... I like to clean the stamper off with unwanted bits and pieces. So there we go. I am going to clean that stamper off on my lint roller. And then we're going to turn this plate around again. I have a feeling... Maybe not. Who knows? We're going to turn the... <laughs> we didn't turn the plate, but we turned the mat around. Oh my goodness. And there's so many cute images, I'm really having trouble deciding which ones to use. Let's pick that one up. That one's like a cute little uh, shell. I really like that one too. Some of these would be really great for uh, advanced stamping. Or reverse stamping or decal making ever how you want to look at it but I'm really liking the stamp and polish this uh, flow stem or float Sam float Sam I like it it's doing a really good job it's showing up really nice over that gold and this one I think is just like a little sea creature might be a crawfish. I don't know. <clears throat> or lobster. So here we go. We're going to clean this whole plate off with some acetone real quick. With my little handy dandy cotton claw. And then I wipe over it with a paper towel to get the smudges off. And I'm going to go in here with a piece of tape and get the excess off of my skin real quick. Not too bad. Not too much to clean up. Then I'm going to break out my little dampen dish with some acetone. Anybody that's watched long enough knows how I am about this cleanup. I'm going to top this with the smudge-free top coat from Maniology. 
I'm going to seal that design in. And then I'm going to use my posh top coat to seal everything in and make it glossy and shiny and dry down. Very nice. So I do love these um, polishes and the plates. So there we go. Here's my swatch photo for this manicure. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave me a comment. I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.